It is 642 and the show Small Town Big Deal airs right here on WSIL TV 3 on Saturdays in the morning and the evening and it focuses on human interest stories in rural America. And of course, joining us, we have Rodney Miller, co-host of the show. You also do it with Jan Carl and you guys are an amazing team on there and do a well, great job. You. So one of the things we want to talk about is you're coming up on a big milestone for the show. Yeah, we start our 10th year on the air, uh, which is kind of an eternity in TV. Mm -hmm. uh, not many people make it that far. Thank goodness we have. And uh, we just had our 150th episode celebration. It's kind of a different thing for us that we uh, shot it in studio. And our producers and editors, I thought, did a great job of kind of, we sat, Jan and I sat, and we kind of talked, reminisced about the last 10 years and and all the different types of things we've shot, which we've been all over America. I think we've shot in 47 states so far, and, and uh, it was a lot of fun. So we've been very, very fortunate. Uh, she's been a great partner, and uh, well, she's put up with me for all these years. I mean, we're watching clips of the show right now, and for folks at home that maybe just tuning in and haven't been able to catch it on a Saturday yet, how did you come up with this? I mean, this is a, a great idea. Y you know, <laughs> I knew nothing about TV. Okay. I'm a farm boy from Southern Illinois. I grew up, you know, out by Thompsonville. Uh, I just had the dream to tell America about the real America. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know, no, no epiphany, I guess, but I just, you know, we just tell the real stories of America and the fun stuff mm -hmm. and, and the not, not sad stuff. And everywhere we go, something good's happening. Right. You know, so we're not telling all the, the, the bad things that are happening. Unfortunately, you guys don't get to do that as much right. as we do. And uh, but so, you know, people seem to like that. And our viewership just grows up. You know, the first episode, we, we were only on, on RFD TV. We had 34,000 viewers, according to Nielsen. No kidding. Now we're on over 300 stations across America. Thanks to eight great stations like ABC here, but we're on ABC in New York too, ABC in right. Philadelphia, and ABC in Atlanta, CBS in Los Angeles. But, but you know, we've grown now that sometimes we have as many as a million viewers a week. Wow. So, so, you know, people seem to like that. Well, you know, people can not only catch you on air, but t today you are visiting the region. You are going to be doing a meet and greet today at the 32nd annual Red Power Roundup in DuCoin. So you're going to be, is it at the entertainment tent? Yes, the entertainment tent at nine o'clock and it'll be real informal and I'll just kind of talk about whatever people want to talk about. I'll kind of give some history of the show and kind of talk about my past. There'll be people here from all over the United States and yeah, come out and I'll be glad to talk to anybody who's there. And, uh, we'll sign some uh, publicity photos and um, tell people a little bit about my past and uh, who aren't familiar with me and uh, be glad to do so. And well, we, it's an incredible show for anyone that hasn't been able to catch it. And if you want to catch it yourself, it airs every morning right here on WSIL TV 3. It airs at 5.30 and then it airs again at 6 o'clock at night. Rodney, thanks so much for stopping by and, and joining us once again. We'll be sure to get this up online so people can check it out. And be sure to get out and check him out today at the DeQuain State Fairgrounds at 9 o'clock this morning at the Entertainment Tent. And Nick, it's shaping up to be a nice day to be out there. Yeah, great weekend.